So the father of the bride said that um, they're gonna go inside and ride it out. So everybody's going inside to do the speeches. I told them I'm not gonna leave my equipment. I might have to shut this down. Hey fam, what's good? It's your favorite Canadian DJ, eh? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to my world. DJ Nine. So I got a wedding for you guys up north. It's a three hour drive to the township of Tiny. Never heard of it, never been. I think the place is tiny. But nevertheless, it's gonna be at a nice house. They have a big tent in the back. They want a party and rage. I'm doing the ceremony and their reception. All right, it's for Jessica and James. Should be a good time. The only thing is the weather is not that great outside. So I don't know what to expect. We got a long drive ahead of us. We'll see you when you get there. Brr. We're here at the venue. It's actually a beach house. We're doing the reception in the tent in the back. It's raining, so there's no way we're gonna have a ceremony outdoor. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you around this, this beautiful location. Oh my God, uh, really strong winds, but it's amazing here. Everything's looking good. Everything's pretty much set up except for my gear. <laughs> Shoot, I gotta get, get cracking. All right, so you'll see the setup in five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> the magic of video. Already set up. Tent looking beautiful now, all the chairs are here. Ceremony done. And there you go, J and J. July 24, 2021. Jessica and James. So pretty. Notice everything is white, except for my booth. <laughs> I'm the dark horse. Yeah. I bring the party. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm working with. I have the Gig Bar 2 right here. I have the Sennheiser uh, E835 with a mic stand. QSC 212s. I have a MacBook Pro 2013. Here's the receiver for the microphone. Western Digital hard drive. I think this is a two terabyte hard drive. Of course, it's the Pioneer DDJ SZ in silver. It's all decked out. Look at that. That's beautiful. I have an ADJ. Uh, four panel facade in black. Taking a break right now. We have cocktails going on upstairs. And uh, yeah, we're just chilling right now. Uh, after everybody's done cocktail, everybody's gonna come down to the, the tent area and have dinner. So we're all having dinner right now. Um, it stopped raining for a while, but now it's raining again. It's actually raining really hard. Water is kind of getting through. Over there there's cracks and stuff, so I'm getting a little wet. 
The power cords that are running to my system are outside, so they're exposed to the water. And then every now and then there's big splashes of water that is just coming down from the ceiling. It's accumulating on the roof, right? So it's just all splashing down onto those cords. I'm expecting this to all shut down. I don't know if Fenty's gonna blow or just the music's gonna stop all of a sudden. Right now, you just have to go with it and we'll see what happens. And hopefully maybe the rain will stop. So we continued on with the program and everybody was having a good time, just focused on the actual wedding and having fun. And they were oblivious to the weather, except for me. Here's Jessica and her father doing the father-daughter dance, having fun with it. They did a medley of songs and they did a great job of getting the crowd into it. And uh, yeah, it was a pretty good time. And then this happened. Yo, this is bad. It's raining and it's windy, like hella windy. And literally the walls are pretty much caving in. This is crazy. Take a look at this. Yo, I'm literally pushing this so it doesn't hit my equipment. So the father of the bride said that um, they're gonna go inside and ride it out. So everybody's going inside to do the speeches. I told them I'm not gonna leave my equipment. I might have to shut this down. You don't actually think I packed up and left, did you? Fortunately for them, the wind did subside and we finished off the night. <laughs> So, there you guys have it. That was the gig vlog. Hope you guys liked it. It was a tough one for me. You know, I wish I didn't have to go through all that. But, you know, sometimes we have to go through stuff like this. You know, the weather is not the best. The situation is not the best. But you roll with the punches, right? I was this close to leaving. I was pretty much packing up and then the wedding planner came down and told me that they're coming down. They want to proceed with the program again. And I was like, oh man, uh, okay, okay. So, and you never want to let your clients down. You know, you, you want to make sure that it, it's a successful night. Everything goes smoothly, but you know, the circumstances of this event, it wasn't helping, right? And sometimes there's a fine line. It's your equipment or your own safety or what? You keep going with the gig and something happens to your stuff. You know, you gotta make a decision, right? And uh, yeah, it was, it was tough, man. But you know, good thing that the wind died down at that moment and yeah, it turned out to be a pretty lit night. I can't lie. Have you guys gone through something like this? Something similar? Uh, a problem like this? Let me know if you guys have down in the comments. Yeah, let's talk about it. If you guys like this gig vlog, please don't forget to give it a big like, uh, thumbs up. And uh, if you haven't already, subscribe. A lot more gig vlogs and stuff coming at you, DJ related. We'll see you guys in the next one. All right, this is DJ Nine signing off.